Hey everyone, welcome to Kate's Critters. So the first thing that I have is based off my experience, if you spray the wheel, then wipe it, it gets a lot cleaner than spraying the paper towel, then wiping it with the paper towel. So most people already do this one, but if you sift your sand with just like a normal sifter, it'll keep your sand cleaner longer, but you obviously still need to replace it every now and then since your hamster will probably pee in it and it'll just get gross if you don't. The next tip is keeping a paper towel tube behind your wheel to keep it from clinking against the glass. Another thing you can do for your hamster is using stuff that's not necessarily meant for them, but you can use for them, such as the things I'm showing here. Just make sure it's safe. This tip is helpful if you're on a budget, so if you see anything that you want to buy but you just like don't want to spend the money on it, and you think you can make it, try and make it. So I use half vinegar, half water to clean his cage, and it's a lot cheaper than buying the cage cleaner stuff that you find at the pet store. So if you don't already have a carrier, I would recommend getting one, but always leave it set up in your closet or wherever you keep it. So if there's an emergency, you can put your hamster in there really fast and get to where you need to go if there's like a tornado or a vet or anything like that. If you don't like not being able to hang stuff on your cage, putting wire or mesh in the back of the enclosure will help. You can hang it from the lid or from the edges of the cage. Now the next tip is to press down the bedding so that your hamster can burrow easier in it. If you're always busy at night or you don't like to stay up late, you can play with your hamster early in the morning. Now I know this isn't best for everyone, but like it depends on when your hamster goes to sleep. Because nutmeg sometimes stays up till even like 7 or 6.30, so I sometimes play with them in the morning. But your hamster might not do this, so you'd have to... Do it based on your hamster and your schedule and all that. But you can check out this video up here if you want to learn more about out of the cage time for hamsters. Thanks for watching till the end. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please consider liking and subscribing. You can also check out these videos and this playlist if you would like to see more. Bye!